Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to Subsistence. Uh, we had an exciting night last night. It's pretty late in the day. I can't even remember what it was that I was going to make. Oh yeah, I was working on that. We needed two rope for that and that's all we need until we want to upgrade it so that we can actually do something with it. Uh, let's go. Oh, that bear is still in my way. That's in the way. Um, let's do some uh, damage to the base. If I can get out of the doorway here. Oh, I'm out of... <laughs> <laughs> he didn't do very much damage. Uh, did I? I did. Yeah, that was the empty spot. I was trying to figure out why I had an empty spot, and it was because uh, I uh, don't have any rifle rounds, and I just used them all. <laughs> That's all right. We'll fix it. Uh, nope, wrong box. Nope, don't have any. There we go. All right, get that in there, and we'll have some actual food today. Uh, let's check on the plants. That one's empty. I haven't even refilled the canteen. We're going to go over there and see if we can find uh, that lock crate. Yesterday's uh, episode, oops. Yesterday's episode was really long because of the rogues. And, uh, oh yeah, we need... Uh, we need actual stuff in here. We don't have much. <laughs> we do have a cotton seed, however, uh, which we picked up yesterday. And there is a cotton plant and a medicinal plant and another medicinal plant. So we can plant a couple of plants. And we need that. All right. So we are out of um, there we go. So we're out of stuff for fertilizer. There's some. That'll work. And now we've got nine. Uh, what was the other thing? Oh yeah, we got to work on that. But, um, I think it was, uh, upgrading the double barrel is what it was. I mean the, uh, it's not a double barrel. The shotgun is what I was thinking. And that is all completely doable. If we put off making a double barrel. Um, there we go. Uh, what was the rest of that? Oh, we need ingots. How many? Two? Just two? And we need to eat. For goodness sake. <laughs> we need to drink water really bad. Wow. And uh, what else was it? <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, oh, just uh, some electrics. Electric. There we go. Yeah, we'll have the rest of that. There's one of them. This just gives us that little extra bit of firepower. <laughs> I kind of <laughs> kind of can't believe that was. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm still waiting on rifle rounds. All right. That's fine. Put that there and we'll refill our canteens. Uh, there we go. What we'll end up with is we'll end up with multiple upgraded weapons. And then when we make the more high powered weapons, we'll have. Um, 
stuff to put in the death box. <laughs> I guess I'll do it that way. Alright, that can go in there. Oh, I forgot. Wait a minute. I completely forgot about the traps again. Gosh, I hope they're still there. Green. <laughs> yeah, we'll fix the traps later. <laughs> Green. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> and green. There we go. Let's put all this away. Uh, there it is. And uh, did I only make two? What the heck? Oh, where did it go? What happened to the rope? Did I not make the rope? Did I make that rope instead? <laughs> what happened there? I'm going to have to watch that one. <laughs> wow. Brain is not so good, I guess. Uh, that goes in there. That can go in there temporarily while I screw around with this. Oh my god. What a goofball. How do I manage it? <laughs> I should probably, uh, let's grab this off of here. And go over here. And repair that first. It wasn't that much damage, but it's definitely worth uh, repairing first, just because it's going to cost more to repair it. And uh, after this is done, I'll show you up at the top uh, how you can uh, see how much damage. So you need to know uh, the base amount of damage. The base amount of damage of any shotgun with a regular shotgun shell is 120 points. So then you get plus 20, and it says plus 20%, but it's literally plus 20. So it makes it worth 140. And don't worry about these, oh, that doesn't go in there. Don't worry about the weapon parts. We're gonna start attacking uh, these guys pretty soon. I'm just going to drop that off there so we can get going. The stairs tripped me out. Alright, any more boxes? There were boxes up there. Alright, here we go. <laughs> I was like, what are those stair things? What's sticking out of the side of the base? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I wonder how hot it's going to be today. It's already 24. There's a blueberry. That will also help. And another carrot. And a rabbit. That would also help. At least one of that. That was. They were both seeds. Alright, well that saves me having to worry about the carrots going off. Oh, he's back. <laughs> he's back and he's alone so let's go get him I might be able to do this with a bow alright now I have to be able to find him though uh, let's see there's his fire should I stand by his fire and wait for him Oh, I ate it and it wasn't cooked yet. Uh, where are you? Dang it! Uh, the, the wolf is hurt. 
But I don't know where the rug went. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Alright, the bear is not hurt. The wolf is hurt. The bear has 140 hit points. There you go. 140 hit points. Where the heck did the rogue go? <laughs> did you eat that rogue? <laughs> I feel like we just spent the night here last night. Might need to stoke his fire for him. How bad is it? No, he's stoked his own fire. We'll cook that up. Oh my god, look at how thirsty and hungry I am already. He's got to come back, right? There's a bag. I don't know how I missed that in the dark. Let's finish him off. Maybe that was him. Maybe the wolf just did him in. And that's why. <laughs> and that's why he's not around anymore. <laughs> oh my goodness. Just me and Mother Nature taking down the rogues. Oh, there's a rifle round. That'll help. <laughs> Oh my god, we may as well cook it all. We'll go wash our hands. Wash my hands of this whole entire mess. <laughs> Alright. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Don't you touch my steak, damn it. <laughs> you leave my steak alone. <laughs> you thought I was making that for you, didn't you? <laughs> Typical man. <laughs> hey, what's my game thinking about, do you think? I mean, my computer. Stop doing that. There we go. <laughs> oh, boy. Man, I'm telling you right now, probably have time to cook water and chop trees with steak. It takes forever. That fern over there looked like a potato. Oh, there's a deer. Nice. I don't always get them, and every time I do, it surprises the hell out of me. <laughs> it's one of the, it's honestly one of the things I worry about the most on a new save, is having the ability to get enough antlers uh, to uh, make the adhesive... Uh, so I can, I was looking for the fire, so that I can, um, uh, what am I trying to say, uh, put up solar panels and stuff. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can find a uh, lock crate before I run out of space. That was pretty funny. I knew there was, there had to be another rogue because, you know, we've pretty consistently had four and we're pretty far in now. Uh, day 42, I think. So, yeah.
Uh, here's another uh, ammo bag anyway. Where have I been finding the lock crate? Has it been down there every time? There's another ammo crate. So from this, uh, I think I've brought this up before. From this tree right here, so there's the corner of the fence. From this tree all the way over to that creek is this lock crate. It's a huge area. All of the, it seems like all the old lock crate areas are just massive areas. And uh, sometimes you can see there's a carrot right there. When there isn't a lot of trees in the way, you can see. Dang it. There's a bear in my way. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Super easy to miss because I'm completely and utterly blind. That dang moose is going to give me a heart attack. Hopefully we're able to make a double barrel before moose season. Because it's pretty well heart attack inducing. Oh, uh, Woofo. I think you might be in the way, but I'll go look somewhere else first. I think there's a bear right there somewhere. Maybe I can see from here. Wipe my eyes off. I don't think it's here yet. Look underneath this tree and then go on up to the fence. I don't really want to play with Charlie today. I'm kind of low on uh, rifle rounds. Spending a long, lazy day of summer, super close to home here. This uh, area of the map is otherwise completely worthless for us because, I mean, we can chop wood up here, but there's no ore up here. There's a tiny, tiny bit of uh, copper and um, iron, I think it is, if we're safe enough to look. Uh, so yeah so we are uh iron mostly yeah all the way around where char uh, charlie's base is you can see it if i can get the glare on it just right you can see charlie's base all right let's go look up here i've never found it up here which makes it prime to find it up here it can also be right on the other side of that creek right there. But I think we'll just be happy that we didn't get killed by that rogue and, and eat a strawberry. I think I will. Where did it go? There it is. I need a lot more than that strawberry though. Yeah, I need to carry some bottles of water so I can make blueberry water. He's 140 points. It's a waste because black bears don't have as much fat as brown bears. But that's where we're at, you know, with the with the weapon. And even if I made a double barrel first before I start uh, started upgrading, it's still only going to be 140 per shot. You can granted, you can take two shots rapidly but you can do that with the regular shotgun too you just have to jump backwards which is tricky i know and just basically take the shot and then jump backwards to try and get out of the way of getting hit but uh i know it's tricky 
It's a trick shot. Where did that thing wolf go? Is he still in my way? Uh, well, I'm not finding it again. He's down there. Most of the ore is up on these two rocks right here. But it's like I said, it's going to be iron. And we have a bucket ton of it. Rabbito, where's the crate? Go on, you can tell me. It's not a super secret. Alright, let's go. That fire is probably burned out by now. Yeah, it looks like it. There we go. We do need that ash. <laughs> Oh, that's kind of a bummer. I was hoping that, you know, if we went over there and we hung around for a little while, that the lock crate would just pop in, you know, and we'd have it. But we'll see if we can uh, build any uh, foundations. I want to deal with this uh, situation going off the front balcony, but I, at the same time, I also want to deal with uh, the uh, starting the fence because it's kind of frustrating to look out the door and see a bear all the time or a wolf in this case there's a wolf out there right now got a little pearl though all right did the fire survive? Yes. Put that on. Eat one of those. Put that on. Oh, we also have this cooked steak. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, and uh, fire starter. Thank you. Uh, and how are we doing? We've got five antlers. Uh, let's see. I think we'll sacrifice all of that ash and um, go ahead and make some more cream sauce <laughs> let's see anything go in there just that we're up to 13 which is great uh, let's see here we've got that we need that we can do that we don't have any lithium so after that's refined, I can still only make one of those, but I can make one of those. And then we'll have one, um, one board done. And let's see. Yeah, I think I'll take a few of these and uh, try to find blueberries. Uh, yeah, we can't eat that yet. I'm surprised it didn't... Oh, I didn't... Yeah, it didn't use... Oh, this part uses the pearl. Good grief. I'll, I'll work it out eventually. Okay. That goes on the roof. That goes there. That goes on the roof. Uh, let's see here. Oh, darn it. Run away! Uh, there's my arrow. Perfect. And we need to fix these because they are not going to make it through the day tomorrow. Oh, that was not, didn't get used. Right, well, we didn't find the lock crate, but we did pick up a lot of crap and we resolved the situation with the rogues. <laughs> <laughs> and I might might just have to move <laughs> I might have to move that thing because it might make Annie crazy 
<laughs> Sorry, I find that really funny. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Because <laughs> I live to make Annie crazy. <laughs> Uh, super short episode, but it's nighttime. It's it's time. So I want to thank you all so much for coming along. I do hope that you have a lovely evening. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.